Okay, let's talk about the hardware then, the Google Home hardware, which looks, of course, like a Me Too product compared to Amazon's Echo. Is it, Stacey? I mean, this is the thing you cover most. This, is, I'm, this was the thing I was most excited about. Um, it's a, well, first of all, we don't know when it's going to be real. So they haven't even announced availability. So Although I the get rumors that. I've heard are that maybe sooner than we think, that they're already in manufacture, right? I, I think they, I, I can tell you that they've got beta units. Right. Uh, but again, so we're, we're basing all this on the video and what we saw. <laughs> right. Uh, right. Like we don't even know what the key, we don't even know what the trigger phrase is. We saw one, at one point somebody said, hey, Google, and it worked. I think it was, hey, Google, which makes sense because they wouldn't want to activate your phone. Right. So you wouldn't. It's anyway. a problem now with the motor, with the Android Wear is that I say, okay, you know who, and both my phone and my watch wake up. Exactly. Yeah. So imagine you had that third device. So the two things that are like different is, well, I guess there's three. One, it looks different and you can choose your design. It's which, pretty. It's much it, prettier. Yeah. I, it, I guess it's prettier. I, you don't think my so? House is, my house has so many of these like white, funky looking, right. glowing LED devices. It's mm -hmm. ridiculous. But it's better looking uh, than the Echo, isn't it? it yes, it the is. The Echo is kind of almost 2001 monolith scary. Yeah. It, it, it's because it's black. Right. It definitely it, looks like I mean, a consumer it, it's really, product. Right. Yeah. So yeah, consumer grade two, for sure. The two functionalities that are cool is it's using Chromecast, that capability. So you can multicast, which is like what you can do Love on the Sonos. So yeah. Yeah. The Echo doesn't do that. And then the other thing in the video, it showed a tie in to like the contextual information we were talking about. And the woman in the video said, Hey, Google, I'm listening in prompt with a beep. And Google was like, Yo, I think her flight was delayed. Your flight's going to be delayed. But imagine. I love if notifications. Yes. Although you can see how people would totally abuse that, right? Yeah. You can be beeping at you all the time. <laughs> but I mean, it'd be great. Like, hey, you know, leave five minutes earlier for your appointment so you're not late. Thanks. Well, you, we've raised in the, both these past two topics this whole issue of the user has to have control. I, I don't, this is the problem because you want to make it very simple. Mm -hmm. uh, you don't want to have a long list of check boxes like I want notifications from this app but not that app. Right. But ultimately, you're going to have to do something like that. I, you know, it may just be, voice might be the boon here. It may be just... Hey, I have a notification from TripIt. Do you want to hear these in future? Something mm -hmm. like that, right? Mm -hmm. Or maybe you just, for now, I mean, in Google now, it pops up the card and you're like, do you care about this? It does ask like, you, right? Yeah. Oh. Right. So maybe that's the sort of thing we'll get initially. And I think context will matter a lot. And if you have this in your home, you're going to be giving... Google, it's, it's kind of like, think about a triangulation, right? Let's say you have this, you have an OnHub, you have your phone that runs on Android. They they can pinpoint where you are really accurately and start giving you, and maybe even who else is with you. I mean, it's creepy. I, no, but, I love this. Google knows I mean, all this stuff already. Right. So if, if they surface that information to give you better products, that's kind of really compelling. I agree. This, I don't know if this is the size. It feels like it's roughly the size. It's definitely the inspiration. This is a Glade <laughs> air freshener. If I take the uh, label off, I bet I could have fooled you. It said, oh, you know what, Stacy? Yeah. You mentioned they're sending these out for beta. I did get mine the other day. What do you think? I'd be so jealous. <laughs> I'd be like... Dang it. And it smells so good. <laughs> I was just I was just about to say that the thing looks like an aromatherapy product in the in the pictures that they have. Ooh, it smells wonderful. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I love the smell of Google in the morning.